And I want to play a video. Well, we're going to start uh, playing it now. And we're going to be uh, once again asking for the media's help to push it out to the public. And then ultimately, we're going to be asking for the public's assistance to help identify these offenders that you're going to see in this video. So I'm going to let the video play, and I'll, I'll talk a little bit, and then we'll uh, and then we'll go back, and uh, and I want to talk about um, uh, Mr. Walker and Andrew Holmes who are here today, who have offered up reward money to try to bring these offenders uh, to justice. So the video is playing now, and uh, or it's about to play, I should say. And this video is, uh, has already been pushed out to the, our news media outlets, and uh, our news affairs is pushing the video out through social media, so everybody should have a chance to view the video and uh, continually to share it with everybody that they know. So as I mentioned, so this is going to be the video. Unfortunately, that's our victim. That is his vehicle. You can see how quickly these offenders get out. See suspect number one with a the gun there. You can see his shoes. There's suspect number two and three. And number four is the driver. There's an exchange of gunfire, and then these suspects will leave. This is just a different angle of the car. That's, once again, suspect number one. They're returning fire. They're shooting back at the victim, at which point they struck him. They all re-enter this vehicle, and they flee the scene. And you can see that guy with a pretty distinctive uh, uh, jacket on. So what we're asking, and this, is, this has worked extremely well before with the uh, community, is we're asking the community to, to view the video, slow it down, share it with everybody. We're fairly certain that if you look at this video, there's going to be people who recognize these individuals, maybe not based upon their face. You can see that their faces are covered, but based upon who they are and based upon their clothing. We're asking that they call Area 2 Detective Division at 312-747-8271 or CPD tip the CPD tip line, and please share as much information as possible. The information can be anonymous, but once again, we, we truly need the information to identify these offenders. You can see how horrific a crime this was, and uh, we're trying to bring these offenders to justice and, and give the family you know, some peace in this as well. So please review the video, please share it, and, um, and please push it out. Um, we did recover the, uh, the vehicle in this incident, so when you look at the video, <clears throat> The vehicle that these offenders pulled up in was another stolen vehicle. It was a Ford Fusion. We have recovered that vehicle out in uh, Tinley Park. And I want to thank all of our South Suburban Police Departments. The Area 2 detectives have been working very closely with them on this investigation. And all of the South Suburban Departments have been extremely helpful supporting us with this investigation. So I want to thank them for that support. And lastly, like I'm mentioning, I really, we, the detectives really need the information here. We truly believe that these offenders can be identified. And the gentleman uh, standing behind me now, um, they have offered rewards in order to bring these offenders to justice. And I'm going to turn it over to uh, Mr. Early Walker at this time uh, um, to speak for a minute. Early. <clears throat> Thanks, Chief. Uh, as stated, uh, my group, I'm telling don't shoot a uh, group of business owners. Uh, we have pledged a reward amount of $10,000 to add to um, the reward amount that's already been placed. Um, here it is, is a man that gave his life to the city. Um, retired, finally was able to retire to try to enjoy his life, and now his life has been taken. There's someone out here that knows who these individuals are. Do the right thing, remain anonymous. Um, as I stated before, I mean, one of the distinct things in our reward money is that you can receive a portion of the funds immediately. I mean, if you need those funds to relocate, to move, we just want justice for this family. Here it is, he was trying to get some popcorn and his life was taken over a vehicle. So we are asking that if there's anyone out here you guys have seen the video. Someone knows something. Someone went to school with one of these individuals. This family deserves justice. We do believe that you guys just wanted the vehicle. You are one of the shooters out here. We don't believe this was an intentional act. We just want you to turn yourself in. This family deserves justice. Do the right thing. Thank you.
Well, of the more than now 1,025 carjackings in the city this past year, we know that this one has truly captivated the city. You could see there clearly the four suspects wanted in the shooting death of the retired Lieutenant Dwayne Williams. That happened just a few days ago. Now we know the award is $18,000. Marie, we also know that that video is now up on our website. The video you just saw, it's pretty, pretty crystal clear. The chief of detective said they think they're gonna catch these guys with this video. It's at CBSChicago.com right now.